Hi there, this is Ronnie Bencer. We're going to help you understand what happened recently to your YouTube channel layout or your YouTube channel settings. So let's jump right over into YouTube and we are already signed in and we're going to go to the upper left corner where it says channel settings and click on that. That brings us to the place where we can see our channel settings. We'll scroll down a little. There's your top portion of your channel. This hasn't really changed much here. We can change the color of the background, choose an upload an image to upload an image. We can remove whatever avatars we've got or change them, those kind of things. Let's go over to info and settings. No real changes here either. This is where you put the title of your channel, description of it so other people can understand why they're there. And you want to load this up with keyword appropriate words so that people when they're searching can find your channel. And then here comes the last part, the tabs. I think I don't remember for sure, but I think there was another tab here that talked about layout. But right now it seems to be hidden. So they have not removed them. They just sort of changed where you find them. So we're in the tabs area. We are talking about our featured tab. And right now we've got the feed chosen. What you're going to want to do is go to where it says featured on the left. Click. And that's where you see what you thought might have been gone or missing. At least I did when I looked around. Couldn't find them. So these are our channel settings. We've got our standard four that we saw up here, but there's also a fifth one that's relatively new. It's been added to the group called Live Broadcaster. It's what you're going to want to use if you're doing Hangouts on Air in Google Plus, or HOA for short. Uh, if you scroll down a little, you'll see sort of what it's going to look like. It's kind of dark, but you'll see the normal Live Broadcast area and channel comments or comments that are going on right there. So you can be an interactive situation. So we want to choose here in the tabs area, go to your featured area and choose this if you're going to be doing Hangout on Air. Uh, also, just as a reminder, your default tab is what people see when they load up your YouTube channel. If you're going to do Hangout on Air, you're going to want it to be set to this featured tab with Live Broadcaster. And if you're not, you can try having people come to the video tab. So they could end up, when they get to your YouTube channel, they'll see all your videos or you can have them automatically show up on your feed, or if you have enabled the ability to do what's called a merch store, you can have storefront. So let's go here back to the featured tab. This is the settings you're probably going to want to keep if you're doing Hangouts on Air. So you get there again, channel settings, tabs, and click on the featured area in order to see it. So then we'll say we're done editing, and there we go. Let's bring this back up. Just to remind you who I am, this is Ronnie Bencer doing what I can to help you keep up with the changes that are going inside YouTube. So go ahead and circle me inside Google Plus, or you can find my furry friend, the video SEO hound Victor, the video SEO hound, by looking for video leads online. Good to see you. We'll talk to you later.